Wood waste diverted from landfill is chipped and stockpiled ready for use. The wood chips are loaded into a hopper and transported along a conventional feed screw into the pyrolysis unit where the process begins. The pyrolysis of the wood chips occurs in a slow revolving heat tube that is designed to be oxygen free. This heat tube is heated indirectly by a series of gas burners, converting the wood chip into char and unrefined syngas. From the exit of the pyrolysis unit, there are two streams, one gas and one solid. The solid char stream is stockpiled for use in biochar applications as a secondary combustion agent or as activated carbon. The syngas goes through a reforming process to convert the long chain carbons into more useful hydrocarbons such as methane, plus carbon monoxide and hydrogen. This gas then passes through a scrubbing system to remove dust and tars to become a clean syngas fuel. The syngas powers a series of engines, similar to those used in gas buses, which in turn spin alternators to create electricity to be used on site or exported back into the grid. The exhaust gas from the engines, similar to that from a conventional gas engine, is then dispersed. Any excess gas not used by the engines is burnt in an enclosed combustor and dispersed. This exhaust gas is the same as that produced by the engines.